Okay, with the uh, the Blackpool bike ride looming, uh, we've ordered, or I've ordered myself, one of the new uh, Polar RCX5 Tour de France uh, special edition units, so I can help my training. If we open it up, I'll show you what comes with the device. You've got obviously the unit itself, and the first thing you notice is that it's a lot smaller, thinner, and lighter than the uh, the Garmin 4 and a 305 that's currently being used. Um, if we go a bit further in, it actually comes with a, uh, a mount so you can mount it to the bike. You don't have to wear it on your wrist, so it's a lot easier to read as you're cycling along. A couple of zip ties which work with the bike mount. You have your cadence monitor mount, and with this edition, you get your cadence sensor included in the package. And the all important heart rate monitor. You have a USB lead for the uh, GPS, which is enclosed here. That's a GPS sensor. You can wear that on your person. It comes with a belt clip, you carry it in a pocket or in a rucksack. And you have the data stick for the wireless transfer. That's the other half of your cadence monitor. And you have several guides. You have a guide for the cadence sensor. A guide for the GPS and a guide for the actual watch itself. So unlike the Garmin devices, all your manuals come included in the box, you don't have to download anything. And the best part of it is you'll notice there's no charger. That's because you don't have the constant frustration of your Garmin watch running out of battery. You don't have to recharge this. It's a standard watch battery inside. It lasts you a good year or two and then once that's uh, run out you can just replace it with a standard watch battery. Uh, if you look for more videos, we'll run through some of the features in more detail and obviously we'll let you know how the training goes so you can see how it hopefully will improve our fitness.